guys and welcome back to my channel so today i am gonna be sharing with you my first ever romwe haul i am so excited um if you guys have been following me for a while you know that i have this certain um hesitation when it comes to buying clothes online i'm not i'm not very adventurous when it comes to buying clothes online because i like to touch the fabric i like to try on my clothes before i buy them so i I somehow don't ever do like massive online clothing hauls or like I'm really averse to trying like brands from Romwe or Choi's or Yuin's and you know she and there's so many other ones um but because of the Black Friday Cyber Monday promotion I decided to like I told myself like bite the bullet and just go out there and buy them um so yeah so today i am going to be sharing with you what i got because the shipment just came in and i have all my stuff unpacked and ready to show you guys i won't be doing a try on haul because i do plan on um using some of these pieces into a lookbook that will be coming up soon on my channel so stay tuned for that and if you guys are wondering um why the lighting is really really off today is because my ring light just did not work so I have to kind of like try and figure out what's going on with my ring light because it just won't switch on and I am deathly afraid that it is like the thing is spoiled I'm hoping that it's just because the light bulb is no longer working so please pray for that and do bear with me because of the lighting is you know it's not even lighting and things like that um but yeah so mo most of like the items i think only a few of the items actually came in this kind of like ziplock reusable ziplock bags not all of them but i do appreciate them because i use ziplock bags all the time to put like dirty clothes in when i'm at the gym and dance studio and stuff so i'm going to just jump into the haul right now um first thing i'm grabbing is yes this is a pleather pair of pants I bought. I've always wanted like faux leather pants. Um, I know it's kind of tacky to some people. Um, but yeah, it's just something that I really wanted. And it was affordable and I thought that why not, you know. Um, but the only thing is that it's, it's, I think it's meant to be worn during the winter because it's really, really, um, thick in a way it's not just it's not just the leather it has this like if you can see this furry thing um my camera would just focus so if you can see it's like this furry thing that is in the pants um that i think is meant to be worn in winter so that it'll keep you warm when you're wearing like leather stuff during the winter so I don't know how I'm going to be able to wear this in Singapore but I just really really like it it looks really really nice just don't think I can survive wearing this in Singapore so it, I really love it it looks really really nice on but it's just not practical I wish that I, I didn't know and it wasn't stated on the website but I wish it was just like the you know the leather and then that would be fine just to wear during this like holiday season but yeah, anyway, moving on. So the next thing I, I bought is this um, like sweater. It's like a drop. It's a drop shoulder because it's like a little bit bigger. It has a cuff end and it's a very, very thin sweater material which I feel like I can get away with wearing it um, to work because it does get really cold at work and I'm always going... It, the distance that I'm exposed to, like the heat is really minimal if I have days where I know I'm going to stay in the office all day long throughout lunch I'll probably just wear this and I'll be fine and I really, really like the colour um, yeah so it's just that next item that I got is this really 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 cool and this is a it's, it's there's no size there's no shape to it it's a raggedy <laughs> sweater <laughs> I bought a sweater that had rips in it but it looks really really nice on the side and in person it's really really nice when you wear it on it has like a three quarter sleeve and what's the really cool thing is that all the slits there is a lining inside there is a lining yep 
so you don't have to wear like a camisole or something like that you can just wear your bra put this on and then you go so i really like that it's it's very very heavy and i can tell that the quality is really really good which i love like it's so nice um yeah i can't wait to wear and style this next item that i got is in is also like a black gray white top i don't know what kind of coloring this is but yeah it's just a long sleeve basic long sleeve like t-shirt has the crisscross in the front that you know it's gonna go it's gonna go like that at the back it has like a drop deep v shape for the back which is really really nice and it's kind of loose so it's not gonna be too hot i did wear this out um for the whole day and it was totally fine really really love it i love like the quality it's really really good um i'll try and put the links in to all the items that i bought in the description box below so you guys can find and check them out for yourselves and then the next item that i got is this mock neck sweater um it's it's a lot redder on camera than in person uh, in person so it's, it's a lot more muted also has that drop shoulder thing with the cuff at the end and this one has like a mock neck so it's like a really small little total neck thing um i i just wanted to try and see whether it would be a sweater material or whether it'd be like more like a t-shirt material but this does feel like it's it's kind of heavy so i guess it does um live up to its name it's, it is sort of like a thin sweater um definitely too hot to wear in singapore but perfect on those rainy days and when i'm staying in the office i tend to stay in the office throughout lunch as well so, I, so i'm getting trying to get like a little bit more sweater stuff um yeah <clears throat> so if you guys find that my voice is rather raspy is because i think i'm coming down with like a viral cough or like a throat infection yeah and so the next thing that i got is this pencil skirt um it is in the mermaid tail print which is crazy and i love it it's made of neoprene material material and it has a slit at the back it fits perfectly well um it's a size m um yeah because of like my hip area so i have a bum so i'm gonna you know i have i have an ass so i'm gonna wear something i just opted for a size bigger just to ensure myself that i can actually wear it and it fits perfectly really really like it i can't wait to wear it to work it just allows me to bring to bring to work a little bit of my personality um so yeah next item that i got is a pair of full leather shorts i bought full leather pants and i have full leather shorts these are things that are on my list of things i want to have fashion wise and although i know that we live in a tropical country one degree north of the equator i don't really care i just wear whatever i want whenever i want however i want um and then yeah so i have a pair of leather pants uh, leather shorts i really, really like them um they're not too hot though they're, they're pretty okay um so this one at least it fares better than the leather pants because the leather pants has that furry lining that you know it's meant to be one during winter this one does not have such a thing it has real pockets and it's awesome i really really like it <clears throat> um moving on i also got myself a dress this dress is absolutely perfect um again it looks brighter on camera than it does in person and it's amazing it's the material it's so like it's not cheap okay this is like good quality stuff and it has this like i guess it's like a bell or like a lantern sleeve with a cuff at the end and it's like a normal it's like a you know really nice shift dress nice for work um i really like it it's one of those basics in like block colors you can never go wrong just wear it with some accessories and it's perfect for work um yeah and then moving on, I also got myself a two-piece set. Now this is a um, like a nude color ribbed. You can tell it's you can see that's ribbed. Um, then this comes with a crop top and a 
midi pencil skirt so it's really really long um, so and then when you wear it together it's really nice because you just see a little bit of your midriff and it's like really nice I bought this one because I wanted to see how like such tan colors would sit on my skin tone I've never really worn like a nude outfit before so this is my first ever um, and it looks really really good on me and yeah so this is definitely a win really really like it <clears throat> um, definitely not for the office <laughs> Um, and then the last item that I got is this dress. I'm just trying to sort it out. Um, yeah, so this is a... It's supposed to be... Well, it's not supposed to be. It is a vintage cut dress. So it's a... You know, back in the... I guess in the 1950s, I suppose. You know, where women wore a lot of like fit and flare dresses. So this was... This is the cut of it. Um, it's like nice boat neck sleeveless fitted at the waist and then you have a lot of like skirt <laughs> so and it also comes with a belt although it's like a very cheap belt you can see it's like cheaply made it's a cheap belt um i really like the print it, it does look like what i saw on the website my only gripe with it it's the material it it's so light and it's so flimsy it's the kind of material that is going to um, get crumpled really easily, I feel. Um, and it makes it look cheap. Like, it makes the whole thing look cheap because the material is so thin and flimsy. Um, I was expecting a little bit more, um, especially when everything else was such good quality and you, and you end up with like something which is so thin. I mean, on camera, you don't see that it's a thin material but if you're in person and you're looking at it like it's that like that this is the neckline and you have this thing like that and it's really really thin so if you know what i mean if you have ever encountered materials like this and the other thing is that this doesn't fit me exactly it leaves like a gap at the you know be like at my back it's it's not like fit, because it's not fitted to me right so it has like a it has like a little pocket at, on my back because it fits me on my waist and my bust area but not um, the shoulder part so I might have to take this to the tailor to get it fitted um, a little bit better because if not it's just weird to wear a dress out with a little pocket in the back. so yeah so yeah so basically that's all the items that i got from romri um do let me know which ones are your favorite items that you've seen in this haul let me know your thoughts um if you guys have ever shopped on romri and what are your thoughts if you have videos of your hauls on romri um do you know let me know i love to watch romri and like all these online fashion hauls i love to watch them um, and yeah, so until my next video, be through, be fascist, and bye guys!